Super Mario Galaxy 2 was released in 2010 for the Nintendo Wii and is credited as being one of the best 3D Marios and personally I think it is full stop without question. It was originally conceived as an updated version of the first game called Super Mario Galaxy More, but thank god they didn't go with that. This sequel expands on the amazing gameplay of the first game but introduces new dynamic environments, new power-ups and the ability to be able to ride Yoshi, which always makes a Mario game a million times better. Now do I need to tell you the story here? Probably not. Bowser kidnaps Peach and heads out into the galaxy and Mario heads out to save her. Again. Uh, but then, if it isn't broke, don't fix it, and it's always worked for Mario, so I mean, why not? Mario is helped by the Lumas, and, as, uh, and has Mario fly a spaceship to fly between the levels, being able to pick and choose uh, certain pathways, taking on optional levels if you so choose, or to go out and collect stars. <laughs> The game plays incredibly well with some very good and sometimes trippy level design. Coupled with Mario's amazing movement, there's always plenty going on on screen um, so that you don't ever get bored, which is always a good thing. But the way Mario moves here, if you shake the Wiimote, you'll make him do a little spin dash thing. You can even point the Wiimote at the screen and uh, pull the trigger to fire... Um, little starshine thingies that you pick up and they can be used to stun enemies and attack certain points of interest and, and whatnot. But overall the Wiimote thing is very minimal and that's always a good thing. Yeah. Super Mario Galaxy 2 was received with near perfect scores and is one of the highest rated games ever. Not just in, in terms of Mario but ever which is quite an accomplishment. It sold 143,000 copies on its first day and then in a, and then 340,000 copies in its first week and as of now it is above 6.36 million copies sold so to say that it's sold incredibly well is a bit of an understatement Overall, Super Mario Galaxy 2 is a fantastic and near-perfect Nintendo Wii game, and I do hope that they port it to the Switch just like they did with the first game, because I truly believe that Super Mario Galaxy 2 deserves to be played on modern consoles. If I had to pick a negative, it would be the fact that there is Wii motion control at all, even though, like I said, it's minimal. But the less Wii motion control in the on the Wii games is the better for me personally. I've said this before on another Wii uh, review video. I really don't like motion controls and all that. I, I understand the fun with the casual market, with all the Wii sports and all that. But in terms of mainline games, I can do without that kind of nonsense. It's definitely worth picking up and it's not that expensive at all given that there's so many copies out there. So if you haven't tried it out yet and you are a Nintendo Wii collector, get in on the action. You will not regret it. It is a fantastic Super Mario game, uh, but you could al always emulate it, which is what I've done here. Now, I originally completed Super Mario Galaxy 2 back in 2010, beginning of 2011, and... I absolutely loved it and I've been playing through it now for this review just to get to grips and remind myself and it is an incredibly fun Mario game and one that uh, I'd be happy to play through again and again, more so if they brought it to the Nintendo Switch. But thank you very much for watching this review and I'll see ya. Yeah.